In this update, we've got Tales of Revenge, Tales of Friendship, and Tales of Heroes Overcoming Insurmountable Challenges. In other words, it's time for the Town Hall 14 Developer Update. So, Town Hall 14 is here, and we're gonna talk about all the cool stuff coming in this update, but where do we even begin? I mean, this update is massive. It's one of our largest updates ever. We've got Town Hall 14, Battle Builders, and we've also got Hero Pets. We've got new upgrade levels for buildings and defenses, new troop levels, and so many quality of life improvements, it would take about an hour just to simply list all the changes going into the game. Ain't nobody got time for that. Okay, so why don't we start with the big one, Town Hall 14. Town Hall 14 is the newest level players will be able to upgrade their Town Halls to after Town Hall 13. With each new Town Hall level, we try to introduce a brand new theme and color palette so with Town Hall 14, we've kind of gone with a jungle theme that draws inspiration from indigenous Mesoamerican architecture. This new Town Hall is one of the most detailed and coolest Town Hall designs ever. Additionally, the Giga Inferno attached to the Town Hall can be upgraded five times. But when Town Hall 14 is upgraded enough, it will release a devastating toxic cloud of poison that damages your opponents as well as slows down your enemy's attacks and speed. When you upgrade your village to Town Hall 14, you'll unlock a ton of new content, starting with Battle Builders. After years of having his creations decimated before his eyes, Builder is finally fed up with having to deal with invading hordes ruining his hard work day after day. This time, he's taking matters into his own hands. Err, hammer. Once you've upgraded your Town Hall to level 14, your Builder Huts will also be able to be upgraded as well. From levels two to four, Builder Hut will no longer just be an extra percent destruction for your enemies. A weaponized turret will deploy and will proceed to defend itself from attacking troops. Additionally, Builder himself will now take an active role in defending his beloved structures. During an attack, Builder will attempt to repair nearby buildings within a certain radius, effectively healing damaged buildings. Not only is the Builder Hut a new signature defense when you upgrade a Town Hall 14, you'll also unlock a brand new building and its new units, the Pet House and Hero Pets. When you unlock and upgrade the Pet House, you'll be able to level up your Hero Pets. Hero Pets are a brand new kind of unit that fights alongside your heroes in battle. You can assign one pet per hero, then mix and match depending on your needs for each attack. Each hero pet can be upgraded, making them even more powerful. From the trusty Lassie, who attacks nearby targets, to the mystical unicorn who heals your hero in battle. The addition of hero pets adds a really cool set of new abilities you can use to customize your heroes. Of course, we wouldn't release a new Town Hall level without any accompanying upgrades for buildings, defenses, and troops. In this update, we've got a new level for the lab, the Clan Castle, gold elixir and dark elixir storages, a cannon, hidden Tesla, bomb tower, eagle artillery, scattershot, bomb trap, and the Inferno Tower. One thing to note is that when you upgrade your Inferno Tower to level eight, while it is in multi-inferno mode, your tower will now get an additional beam for a total of six. Finally, not only can you upgrade 100 of your wall segments to level 15, we're adding an additional 25 new wall segments for you to add to your village as well. We know you're excited to check out what the new wall segments look like, so here they are. Aren't they gorgeous? Defenses aren't the only thing getting upgrades. The following troops will be able to upgrade an additional level as well. Barbarian, Archer, Walbreak, Baby Dragon, Healer, Minion, Valkyrie, and the Ice Golem will all be able to be upgraded one extra level when you upgrade your lab to level 12. Additionally, if a troop has a super troop version, 
then the new level will be reflected on the Super Troop as well. Finally, we're introducing so many quality of life improvements, game balance changes, and bug fixes that they're too numerous to list in this video. So please, make sure you check out the official patch notes for a full list of features being released in this update. So that wraps up our preview for the Spring 2021 Town Hall 14 content release. Please remember to click like and subscribe and make sure you leave a comment below. Until next time, clash on. Is this thing on? Darian, are you there? Darian, I'm ready to record. Are we doing this dev update thing? Hello, Darian. Ready when you are.